and let's talk about story sticks this is one that we make I use it and I like it and this is a tape measure typical tape measure okay one thing you have to know about tape measures is that the clip over here all right has a play by design about a 30 second you can see it moving all right why because when, when you take inside measurements you you have to take into consideration the thickness of the clip over here and the only way to do that is to actually have this moving okay because I'm gonna take the measurement from inside here I actually have to push the, the tape measure against it to move the clip I'll tell you why later and I'm taking my measurement from here I'm 28 and a quarter now when I need to cut another piece to fit here I have to take the measurement from outside okay right here so when you take your measurement from outside now you have to go you have to force it to move it right here by a 30 second it's gonna move by itself actually except if it's stuck so if your measurements are wrong sometimes you have to remember about this okay and now I take my measurements and uh, automatic the tape measure adjusts to by a 30 second but there is a problem with, uh, with these things here and if you come closer I'm going to show you the problem right here this thing is bent it always gets bent this is something that everybody knows and I never saw a company so far to try to fix this problem here you can see that the tip is touching and the tap is up by a 30 second you can, I can see it so what you need to do you have to make sure that this is straight square alright with the pliers you can fix that so if you're wondering why your, your, your cuts are, are not perfect all the time is because of this to eliminate this problem you simply try to eliminate the tape measure and you use other methods the oldest method must be about 5000 years old maybe even more is a story stick uh, you can make your own story stick by having two pieces of wood and then you can screw them together or you can make a hole over here and you know have it adjustable there are many different places in uh, everywhere to learn about story sticks and I think there are a few companies that they do make some um, we're gonna make one that is more suitable for the easy one and for just about anything let's say you're taking measurements for windows for doors for uh, for anything you can use this this is not just one purpose tool um, here you I have a very low profile uh, neural nut because I want this to be a stop over here we mill this end right here so the extrusion moves straight because if that don't move straight that can throw out the measurement okay so it's sliding anywhere self aligns you tight you know it's straight now the top it's a connector inside that slides anywhere okay it gives you double the capacity now this is all heavy duty stuff um, that's all we have I mean um, you can make your own or uh, you can you know um, but we're not gonna make it to bend and try to save money because we know there is a problem having uh, thin aluminum okay this plastic was actually special designed to fit here inside the SME right right here it goes perfect 
and you can actually slide it. You can see it slides nice, tight, no play zero. But you don't have to use this, you can use this end over here. So you put this against here, right? And um, you extend your story stick. It has to be parallel, of course, you can look by eye. Okay, and let's let's do a test. I want to set my sliding fence and I want to make sure that it's perfect. Okay. Let's go anywhere. Right here. Let's say I want it to be right here. I have to, of course, select one spot. Right here. I bring my storage stick to the very end, I make sure the bottom is locked, right here, and I extend, okay, I bring this down, of course, I'm sorry, I keep it parallel, okay, and I extend this right here until I touch this end over here, right here, the first point. Let me do it right here, it's even better, I touch this point here, okay, now I come here, I want to make sure that this here is touching, okay, it's actually it's, it's okay, it's fine, so we tie that. Now I go to the far end over here, okay, this one is way out, it's about an eighth. I bring it in and I like this in. Double check everything. Perfect. Now, let's use a very inaccurate tape measure, but it doesn't make any difference because we're going to use it the same way, so whatever is out is going to be out everywhere. Okay, I want to see how good I am here. Okay, you can come close. It's 31 and a quarter, right here, right here, it's 31 and a quarter, right here, it's 31 and a quarter, okay, to, the, now, that means that I have a square fence to the table, the way the table is designed is if one if two parts are square, like here you can see there is perfect square, everything else is square, okay, because this here works from here, you can see here, there is square, and um, everywhere. I can use a square to do the same thing, but having a story stick gives you additional benefits. Because let's say I want to do routing and I want to put a stop over here, anywhere. If I'm here and I'm looking at the tape, the numbers on the tape, because I'm looking like this, I really have to bend every time and I have to go like this to, to look down straight. I don't want to do that. And again, I have, I'm not sure if the clip is accurate anyway. So. What I do, now that I know that everything is straight, I use my story stick. Okay. I bring it inside here. Now you're going to see that story stick becomes very small. Let me just do it here so you can see it. You see? I move this anywhere. And I'm going to actually start from here, from this end. Okay. Now I can easily keep it parallel as much as you can. And I can easily touch the wood over here. This is my dimension that I want to set my stop. Of course. I set my stuff over here. Okay? Now, I do the same thing on my other stuff, right here. 
from the frame. So my other stuff, it has to be, I don't have another one, but I have this one here. It has to be right here. This is what I like about the easy one, the total open design. If anything is in your way, you just move it, okay? Of course, that has to be like the square here. Okay. So, using the storage stick, you have super accurate setups, one here, one there, one anywhere. And uh, this tool can be used for unlimited uh, situations. I mean, uh, you always need the tool that you can take exact measurements from to the smallest measurement. I'm going to show you how small this thing becomes. Okay. This thing becomes zero because I can take my measurements from here to here. I can, that's my story stick. Or I can simply ro rotate this right here and use this end as my story stick. So having the versatility, I cut this knob before with the hacksaw just to show you that's a quick demo and I'm not going to waste my time right now to try to put this back in but basically you want to have a, a low profile let me do it a low profile uh, nut over here so this way you can use this end, this end, this end okay you see how nice and smooth it slides in. That's my story stick over here. Let's say I want to get an exact dimension from zero to anywhere. Okay, there is no better way to to do measurements, and you can use it for cabinetry, for floors, for just about anything. And having this flip stop getting out of the way and come down to activate it is just perfect. Now, I'm going to go on the other side of the easy one and I'm going to show you that how accurate the whole setup is all this time. So what we're going to do is use this pen over here and come in and touch right here. You can see that I'm touching here, okay? And then come over here, and you can see that I'm actually touching this here. And you can go just about anywhere, and you can see, and you can see that you're perfect. Okay? Now, here is a story of the story stick that um, there is no better way to do your setups for just to take off measurements and execute your work with this baby here. So we're gonna start making and offering this because I think the, the potentials are unlimited here. Now, if you have the repeaters or the cabinet maker, you know what to do, okay? That's all it is. What I'm using right now is a part of the easy system that works like a story stick. Uh, many parts on the easy system actually work like a story stick, even the Super SRK. Okay, so thanks for watching and remember the story of the story stick. It's the oldest story in construction, I believe, and uh, this one must be over 5,000 years old, even, even more. I can't believe anyone building anything without a story stick. Okay, thank you guys.